Twitter question from judge number four, Nigel Barker. Nigel Barker, what's your question? Hi there. Listen, as an international ambassador, do you believe that speaking English should be a prerequisite to being Miss Universe? Why or why not? For me, being Miss Universe is not just about knowing how to speak a specific language. It's being able to influence and inspire other people. So, what so whatever language you have, as long as your heart is to serve and you have a strong mind to, to, to show to people, then you can be Miss Universe. Thank you. Select a card. And Miss USA, you're actually roommates with Miss Australia, right? A little friendly competition. Wow, that's like exciting. That. Well, you chose judge number 10, Jimena Navarrete. What's your question? What is something you have done that you would never do again? Hmm. Okay, well, first I'd like to start off by saying that every experience, no matter what it is, good or bad, you'll learn from it. Um, that's the name of, that's just life. But something I've done I regretted would probably be picking on my siblings growing up because you appreciate them so much more as you grow older, you get closer with your family, but everybody fights with their siblings, right? So, but I don't regret it. <laughs> Is Miss Olivia of Awesome Miss USA. Hello. Hello. And Janine, Miss Philippines. How are you, ladies? I'm, we're fine. We're great. Are you guys always gorgeous at this early in the morning? <laughs> Just wake up like this. We Look at you. Oh, please. I'm like a troll over here. I'm like, don't are get you any cats here. I'm with like these ladies. Congratulations on your, you. on your titles, which is fantastic. Thank, Thank you. Thank you so much. Are you guys enjoying your time in Vegas so far? Absolutely. It's my first time here. So. <gasps> really? Yeah. Oh, you have, but you're having a wonderful time. Yeah, absolutely. Well, what's so great is obviously we know if you're pageant holders, you're beautiful, you're gorgeous, you're poised, but you guys really have true beauty from the inside, especially with what you're doing to help out kids. And, you know, Olivia, tell me a little bit yeah. about this art project. So we had the honor of working with Design and Wine, and we created these awesome pictures that will be benefiting Care for the Kids, and you can go to paintlv.com to bid on our beautiful artwork and to be completely honest with you I am no artist <laughs> you know Janine tell us how this helps actual kids I mean when people buy this art and, and bid on it okay. how does this go to money to help kids okay the proceeds of the, of the bidding will go for the treatment of the kids who can afford the medical treatment mm -hmm. so it's really a noble cause you can bid from December 14 through January 14 and I bet you, you know, coming from the Philippines, being a part of giving back to your community is so important. But wherever you go, I'm sure you travel the world, you yeah. know, being Miss Philippines. And is it interesting, too, that when you do own a pageant title like this, that's yeah. it's important to show other girls who aspire to be like you, to, that's this what's truly yes, beautiful. Yes, absolutely. They have to know that pageants are beyond just beauty. You know? Absolutely. They have a deeper meaning. And this is an example of it. <laughs> Ku ke awan dua tu 
Yeah.